So what is the result of suffering and endurance and character building? Verse 4 again, and endurance produces character, and character produces hope. Hope, that's an interesting word. As a noun, it means joyful confidence. But as a verb, it means almost the exact opposite. It's the desire for a positive outcome in the midst of uncertainty. Oh, that was a bad car accident. I hope he's okay. Oh, I had a job interview today. I hope I get it. Two different things, when it's a noun or a verb. But what Paul is talking about here is the noun, hope. Having gone through the storms and experienced God's protection and provision, seeing God keep his promises, we have joyful confidence in him, in the future he promised for us, and that we're truly his. Like I said, this hope is not a verb. This is not something we do, but it's a noun, something we have. We've been given that. Our joyful confidence in Christ won't put us to shame. Why? Verse 5. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. Because this hope is not based on our flawed and insufficient abilities, but on God's perfect and unfailing love that is present in us, His Holy Spirit. 